Mimi walinipatiza jina wakaniita wajakehe. 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 Walipo leka ngo. Hivyo wajakehe na mama yangu na baba yangu wajakehe unajua kumaanisha nini? Wajakehe. Wajakehe. Ni kumaanisha wao ni msichana bibi. Yesu asikiwe Masaa yetu yamesonga nashindwa nikuhubiri hapa nituombe twende nyumbani Bwana Yesu asikiwe Dada iwe Yesu Ndio kenye kwa kwa tunge Yesu mubea Napenda kikamba na litaizwa tu Bwana Yesu asikiwe Epo ni ingie kwa mjumbe ambao Bwana amenipa na sitaki nichukue muda. Mungu amenipa ujumbe leo. Ya kwamba hakuna mtu anajua jina yako. Tangu soma neno liko hapa na sitaanzia mwisho ijapokuwa nilikuwa nataka kuelezea lakini sasa muda umeni Sukuma sana. Tuingie katika ruku. Chapter number 1. Ruku cha chapter 1 verse 59. So it was On the eighth day that they came to circumcise the child and they would have called him by the name of his father, Zacharias. His mother answered and said, No, he shall, call, she, he shall be called John. But, but they said to her, There is no among your relatives who is called by this name. So they made, they, made, they made signs to his father what he would have him called. And he asked for a writing tablet and wrote, saying, His name is John, so they all marveled. Immediately his mouth was opened and his tongue loosed and he spoke, praising God. Amen. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Nimekwambia jina lako ni Mungu analijua. Bila sisi tunakujuana nikubahatisha. Na nilikuwa nasoma hii neno nikakumbuka. Brother yangu kule last bomb. Sijui kati ya mama yangu na baba yangu ni nani alikuwa kwa roho. Na kama kuna watu wanashinda na majina kwa
wanasukwana sana na Zakaria na Elizabeth. Wakasema kwetu familia yetu. Hakuna mtu anaitwa. Hakuna mtu anaitwa Yohana. Hivyo haiwezekani aitwe Yohana. Nashukuru Mungu wa mbinguni. Zakaria alikuwa amefanyika kuku pale na baba huyu. Alipouliza malaika swali, malaika akamfanya bubu, akaongea mtoto akizaliwa. Biblia inasema wakapishana wakapishana, wakachukua ubao maana baba haongei. Na ukiri kwa muda mchache. Zakaria akaongea na ishara. Kasema leteni bao tunasumbuania nini? Mimi natua china ya mtoto.
Kuna kitu Jehova ameandika katika ubao wake. Na ameandika hivi, nitakubariki, nitakuinua, ukaenda mbali, watoto wako wataheshimika hata wachawi wa kwenu hawatakuta yale maandishi, hata watazi wako Mama, 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 mama,
nilipata hiyo hata hakunifikisha kupita maana alikuwa anakuta mama wa kesho na huyu jamaa anakosa maana tabia hairuhusu nikuwe mama ya mtu au nikuja kupika mimi ni Mungu kwa kweli nisaidie huko chapati alikuwa anapika akibakisha tatu anaita msichana wake fast kwa wakati sipo kama mimi hivyo mimi hata sasa kujua kama anapika chapati hapa ugani au kutoka ndani yani niko na huko chini mimi na kutoka nikipata nikirudi hata sina haja ya chapati yangu mama alikuwa anaona mtu ambaye hana kutumaini kule kabisa anafikisha msichana wake kupika chapati sasa anabakisha tatu naye mama ana yana
najaza mawe hapo na boka nyumba papa papa wao sina kwa kana papa watu kwa kuna watu na wapi wachi tu sasa sisi hapo huko nje huyu mtoto wenu ametulima amani kwa ibros mama ina boka ni kama kwa risasi zinapita kwa mabati mama hadi anatoka nje namwambia nikwambia hapa hakuna kazi inafaa hata kama ni wewe mama yangu umeliga jina gani Yeah. 
Yale matendo Mungu anafanya leo ni ushuhuda wa siku ya kesho. Kesho tukutane katika uwanja wa ku give, ku give testimony what God has done. God bless you so much in Jesus mighty name. Wacha niombe na wewe baba kwa jina la Yesu. Ninaombea wote ambao wanatutazama na kutusikiliza. Naomba ukawabariki, ukawainue walio na shida watembelee ambao umefungiwa nyumba. Mungu naomba uwapatie a new idea ili wa succeed in life. May the Lord connect you them may the lord lord lift them in jesus name i declare favor and grace upon your life and i believe tutakutana kusema what god has done god bless you so much in jesus name we pray say amen amen god bless you so much.